Hi, sometimes we have questions on why is my unit stalling or not ejecting at a low flow? Hi, I'm Lee with Dosatron and Dilution Solutions, and today I'm gonna to go over some of the issues that you might be having. Number one, if you have a really super low flow, the first thing you wanna do is check our specification sheet. This has the low flow specifications and the maximum flow specifications for all of our units. If you're really down or below the capacity of the unit, you might want to look at a different unit. But say we're well within the capacity of the unit, but we're still having some issues at lower flows. What is causing it? Some of what can be causing that is wear from bad water quality. Uh, bad water quality without good filtration can make these piston flanges wear and also the housings wear. You can see on this one, this is one that we got in, and these flanges are pretty shot. Uh, here's another example of that where you can kind of see just the wear on these, and they do not fit tight in the housings. And at a lower flow, these will stall. Also, uh, the guide rod in here uh, will kind of wear. This also happens when you have grit or, in, or particles in your fertilizer or your stock tank. So you wanna make sure that you keep the foot filter on your Dosatron at all times. Another thing that causes wear on the piston flanges in the housing is crystallization. This can be caused by iron deposits or other chemicals you may be injecting. Make sure that you have good filtration, good water quality, and are injecting good quality products, and your Dosatron will last you for many years. If you have more questions, please contact us on our website or give us a call.